The marriage debt is the obligation between spouses to have intercourse and to yield to the request of either spouse for the fulfillment of that debt. St. Paul writes about this debt in 1 Corinthians 7, 3-4, which says, The husband should fulfill his duty toward his wife, and likewise the wife toward her husband. A wife does not have authority over her own body, but rather her husband. And similarly, a husband does not have authority over his own body, but rather his wife. Thus, in this matter, the couple are equals. The 1917 edition of the Code of Canon Law expresses this duty, saying, Matrimonial consent is an act of the will by which each party gives and accepts perpetual and exclusive rights to the body for those actions that are of themselves suitable for the generation of offspring. And as Article 1601 of the Catechism similarly remarks, this union is, by its nature, ordered toward the good of the spouses and the procreation and education of offspring. As this topic is complex and easily misunderstood, further questions are dealt with by St. Thomas Aquinas in the supplement of his Summa Theologica, question 64, which is linked below.